What's going on everybody? Welcome back to G-Miles World. Right now we're going to be taking a look at this combine promo in full depth. We're going to decide are we going Deion Sanders for free by taking off our power up pass with ED. All those other good things that you guys want to know about we're going to go ahead and tackle right now. So when you first log in you're going to get an NFL combine welcome pack. Now this by no means um, is supposed to do anything for your team. If you're just starting Madden, even if you're just starting, there are so many other things uh, that are available. So what we're gonna do with these, I don't think that we really need to have them um, in the lineup right now uh, for anything that we have to do, but we're gonna go ahead and double check a couple things because sometimes they may uh, do something to where you have to. So as far as the team captains go, they do have a new thing. Um, earn a team captain talking about adding a combine player to your lineup when winning five games. Uh, it ends March 6th, uh, 10 a.m. Make sure you guys get that done. Um, it should be any combine player. So because we're gonna be going after Dion, once we create him or we utilize our power of pass to get him, that'll be something you can do. I've always shown you guys on a regular basis how to get uh, the team captain token super fast. That will be coming out for you very, very soon as well for you guys to just go through it. But for now, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be taking a look at what's going on with the sets, all right? Because everybody wants to know, you know, combine, what's up, what's going on, anything new? All right, so pretty much what you're looking at right here, all right? When you complete this set, you're going to get the same way I told you when I kind of gave you a preview yesterday. If you guys watched the video, let me know in the comments if you watched the preview video yesterday. I told you guys that, you know, Amari Cooper, Denzel Ward, and Alvin Kamara would be those guys that you would have to put into the set to actually get Dion, and then you would get back, I guess, all the nets. Um, and that 90, yeah, so you get back all three Nats. But the problem is, do we need all these players and what are the prices of these players? So he's 306, let's see, so it's like a mil. What's Dion going for though? That's gonna be an interesting thing. It looks like it's gonna be about a mil, bruh. Oh, any combine player. It's any one of them. So they did it like that. So look, pretty much because it's any any 96 overall combine star player, that's almost a million coins. Now, before you guys start doing this weird stuff, always analyze what the price of the actual Deion Sanders is going for. We're gonna go through the rest of that set in a second, but I want you guys to take a look at the price of what he is. Because if, he's definitely gonna be less than a million coins, so if you would have to evaluate the training aspect of it and the card that you're gonna use because we already have a 96 overall power pass, but this would actually save us from having to go ahead and use that power pass if we were to complete um, the actual set. So let's see what his price is. All right, so he's at 690. So you would be losing about, th uh, what was that, 320? No, 310. Uh, no, 210 right now because he's at 690. So if somebody were to buy this, let's see what happens. Let's see if somebody were to buy this because 210 wouldn't be that much of a, you know, it wouldn't be that big of a deal. We would complete the set we would actually, you know, sell him and then still use our 97 overall power pass, but for 210, we would get three nets. Um, would we have to use those other cards? Probably not, but you gotta make sure that you understand what's going on because most people are not going to understand it and they're just gonna rush and buy the card. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna rush and buy the card and not understand the whole aspect of it because we would wanna use Denzel Ward um, that Nat Denzel water actually be valuable and then we'll have the other two. I know for a fact, I don't care about the Alvin Kamara and the other card and the Amari Cooper. So those two Nats would eat, you know, instantly be sold. So because I have these coins, we could take the loss for the 210 for 296 overall Nats because the training would probably make up for it even though it's half. You see what I'm saying? The issue is this though, we're not gonna keep that Dion because that Dion is gonna be going into, we're gonna use our power up pass on Dion because this 690 is more than the player that we have it on currently, which is um, Eric Dickerson, all right? So because you see his the card is up there and nobody's buying it, that's gonna be an issue. Because if you complete the set, if you're like me, you want your money right away. You're not trying to play games and you know, oh, let me see what happens here. You wanna get it done and get those Nats back and then figure out what's going on after that. But you know, the bottom line is we have some things that we have to do. Obviously, um, you know, Cromartie, if you guys have been following the channel, that one person uh, yesterday that got it right, I definitely love the comment because he was the first person to say the reason that we're all over Denzel Ward is because Cromartie's garbage. Uh, he got that uh, for the trivia question uh, yesterday. So pretty much right here, you can go ahead and take a look at what's available here. The 96 uh, overall combine star, Mari Cooper, trading four of the, um, you know, four 89 and 93s, 785s, all that stuff. A random combine standout. See, the, this is where you start playing around um, and you want to see what you can get out of it. The combine conqueror tokens. 
traded two times 85 to 93 overall combine standouts to earn a fantasy pack with all three combine conqueror tokens you choose one and it's repeatable so it looks like you'd have to do this a couple times to get the conqueror uh who was going to be dk metcalf all right um it's up to you guys how you want to work with the rest of it uh at this point right now based on the way that it's looking it doesn't appear that the other cards are actually available right so only amari cooper is there this is what the issue is going to be we can go look now and see if that denzel ward is actually available because now i'm starting to realize what they're saying they're going to be releasing it in sections so if we wanted to get those other cards right now the only way we, we would be able to get them is for free by using a power up pass because i don't even see denzel ward uh in the store currently but we'll check it again in the auction house but let's go check out um his card we're gonna go to the cornerback we're gonna check out team we're gonna go browns and then we're gonna check his power up and see what's going on and see if we were even allowed at this point to get him to that level let's see okay so yeah we can get him this way now look just just hear me out really quickly right we're gonna go check to see something in the store because it looks like because you see look how we're clicking it and i didn't see the other ones maybe he is available and we didn't look look down and the other ones are going for more um when we click that but they only showed amari cooper and i told you guys amari cooper is going to be trash can status because he's just not fast enough unless he's on the theme team if he's not on the raiders um or any card if he's not on the raiders or anything like that or, or the cowboys he's not going to be a good card all right drop all the way down to 642 all right so look completing the set is out of the question all right completely out of the question because you're not going to get back as much and it's too easy to complete the set so let's go ahead and scratch that we're not completing the set all right so let's get that out of the way and then now what we're going to do is we're going to type in ward um and see what his price is what is he doing okay so maybe okay so he's definitely not available yet i guess he's not they're going to be doing it in three phases so his card will be coming later but you can still do it now and get the um you can still currently get the Deion sanders so let me go ahead and just make sure by by looking through this that you know they're definitely not available so that when we get them now you know we definitely got them for free because nothing else is available so he's up at 225 right there all right um would i spend that probably not i'd rather complete the card all these other ones are up so look it looks like he's not available yet what about um what is the other idiot's name oh I, well yeah whatever bro the dude's garbage i don't really kamara yeah that dude's garbage bro like dog if i catch any of you guys running around with kamara does he get human joystick in this game like, bro, the dude is probably garbage, man. I'm, I'm not, yo, bro, I'm not, I'm not sold on this, man. All right, okay, you got that one. That dude's garbage. All right, cool. All right, dudes are trash. All right, so look, now we realize exactly what's going on. It's all about, um, how did, um, uh, uh, what, Amukamara get in there? Now we realize what it's all about. So let's, let's go ahead and jump down to what we're doing. We don't want to spend the 600, right? We absolutely don't. So the way, I just showed you all the sets that are currently available right now. So we have a few things that we're going to do, all right? The first thing that we're going to do right now for this video only, we're going to go ahead and we're going to get Deion Sanders, his 97 overall card and complete his set for free by getting um, the last upgrade off of uh, Eric Dickerson. So let's go take a look at what's going on with his card to begin with. We're going to go take a look at Deion Sanders right now. I know many of you guys understand what's going on. Some of you guys that are just getting involved with Madden, you're going to have to understand that grinding through the game is going to help impact your team overall by making these right decisions and deciding when to spend money and when not to. All right. that That's the biggest part about Madden. Um, they, okay. So look, this is even, bro, this is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. Let me tell you why. You are not spending anything. If you have the power of pass available, because we're going to take it off of Eric Dickerson and just get this guy completed for free. Look, this this is wild because I like that you don't got to do no training. You don't got to do nothing. All you have to do is just get the 97 overall power pass. That's all you have to do. And we're not going to actually buy his card. OK, we're going to get the power up pass and then we're going to complete him. And then we're going to go through the other ones because I'm going to show you guys uh, a couple of tips and tricks about how we're going to actually get the other cards that we want which is probably only Denzel Ward. So this is actually really, really cool right here that EA Sports is not trying to get any more uh, cash out of us uh, with the way everything else is going. So look, now that we know what's going on, let's go over here to Eric Dickerson. Let's see what his price is. Because listen, guys, if worse comes to worse, we can always sell uh, Saquon Barkley because we, we only spent 110K to create him. So he, bro, that dude could be gone right now, like without even thinking about it. 
we wouldn't even bat an eye on it, bro. Like, to be honest, I'll probably sleep better with him being raid sold. I'm going to be honest with you about it. All right, so look. Eric Dickerson, let's go over there to his 97 overall card, which was in the fours yesterday. So it's at 465. We could have bought it for a lot cheaper. Um, we could bid on this and try to snag it. But what might happen is this. Let me just explain to you what might happen. If we try to be cheap right here, we may end up losing big. But this is the way that we're going to get the power up pass off of the Eric Dickerson that's available now. So look, let's back out of that real quick. Um, I'm going to show you guys what's going on so that everybody understands what's happening. I'm going to um, show you uh, so you can see what's, what, you know, how we're going to actually get it done. This card right here, we got him for free before, right? Now we're going to have to actually pay for his card and get Deion Sanders for free instead. So you'll see how we get the 97 overall power up pass back. We're going to have to put that extra card back on him. So that's why we would be in a bid for that card so that you guys understand it because it's about interchanging players. So in this video, you're going to see us actually buy Eric Dickerson, but at the same time, we're buying him so that we can get another card for free. You see what I'm saying? And then as it goes on, you get the cards for a lot cheaper. You keep your coins up while everybody else is running around buying the cards for full price. We don't do that around these parts. So look, it's still, it's at four, it's at uh, 383. Yo, is it a chance that we'll get it for cheaper? There's a chance. You see, but the thing about these bids that are dangerous, guys, I want you to understand. At any point, if somebody buys that out for 465, we're going to have to end up going after, you know, the next one for 473. And then if somebody is smart enough to see what we're doing and how we're utilizing the power up passes, then we're going to be totally just screwed because then we're going to have to end up going after the 532. So these are risky things, but it's worth a shot. You know what I'm saying? Like it's worth a shot to see because some people will just stop doing it or they'll stop early and then okay see you see what i'm saying somebody just bought it so now we have no choice now now we just lost that so we have to buy the other one and we see how fast i did it i didn't even think about it because that's what's going to happen somebody else knows maybe they watch our videos and you know they're part of the gmi's world fam maybe they don't maybe they're just smarter and they know because now most of us got eric dickerson for free so if you want to go into weekend league without eric dickerson more than likely you're going to lose games so it won't be that smart of you to do that now, remember, we're going to need to get training back because we're going to actually lose training when we take the power of pass back. So always keep that in mind. When you downgrade, I believe you're going to lose like half of the training uh, value. So let's go ahead and analyze that as well. So we're going to take our 97 overall power of pass back, right? Now we're going to go back to add um, the Eric Dickinson that we just bought. Okay, so now we we actually paid for him. Paid a lot less than he was going for at the time because he was up to like six six fifty or whatever when he first came out. Now they took away a couple things from us, right? We got to get back. What did we have there? We had evasive here. Yeah, I think we had evasive because arm arm bar is stupid, so we didn't get that. I don't think. Uh, so we have to go ahead and craft that ability. Give him evasive back. Um, we could. You know what's weird? I don't like. Okay, we got to take that clutch off. I think we might have to just go. Should we just give him spin cycle? I don't know. Or maybe just juke by that. Nah, I like to spin around and juke. Nah, we got to leave it the way it is. But this is stupid right here. Because this clutch, it don't really like it never really comes into play. At least for me. I haven't really seen it come into play for me. So it is what it is. Um, so we're going to go power run times four back to where he was before. All right. And then we'll add that back to him. And then his front card art still appeared. No, what, what happened to this? Oh, we don't, do we have enough to make that? Uh, no, that's not what I wanted right there. Where is it? The what I was using before. Was it the, this one, the mental? Okay, we gotta we gotta find the one we like. I don't want that one back. That the brother dude wearing goggles, like, like bro, I'm good with that. Nah, we're good with this. I think we had one of these other ones on because we didn't use that one. I think it was this. That might have been the one. Yeah, let's craft that one, and then we'll equip them with that. All right, so that's fine. And then we got Sprinter on him. So now he's completed, all right? So we spent whatever, the, the 473 to get his card back. So he's all set. Always remember that you're gonna have to put back on um, his abilities and his x Factor. you gotta activate him. Always remember that. So go back over there, make sure that he's activated. That's the worst thing to do, is to go into the game and he not be activated and you be sitting there like, okay. Like it's really, really wild. Now, we go ahead and we go and we get De uh, we go get Deion Sanders for free. We're gonna simply go use our power up pass and get him for free completely. There's no training involved, so all those guys are like, "Yo, bro, why you keep saying free?" Somebody in the comment section, please let me know how much I'm about to pay for Deion Sanders. Cause look, look what I'm doing here. Look, look, pay attention. 
What, what What's going on here? Did I buy Deion Sanders? What is that right there? Okay, it's a power up pass. Thank you. All right, so now we have Deion Sanders. Very, very disappointed that they did not make him a gold 99, but they might end up making him a gold, nine, a gold 99 in different instances, you know, how EA Sports does things. All right, so let's go ahead and um, take away, we're gonna refund this, because I believe he should at this point be able to get lockdown times four. So lockdown, lockdown times four, we're gonna go ahead and do that. All right, grab that real quick, and then now he's good. Good to go, no issues at all. Everybody's good, the sprinter, because I think sprinter is max at times too. All right, so that's Dion, completely free. EA made it very, very easy. All you have to do is simply just go up there and add the power pass to him. This is what you're looking at. So now we're gonna be able to see if the 99 speed and the 99 Excel actually means anything. I want all of you guys to take notes and try to figure out, is it something really going on to where that uh, 99 speed in green really is different from the chemmed up speeds? Because if you see any difference, then we're on to something. Then it makes sense, like, all right, EA's been doing whatever they want for way too long. Like, bro, what's this about? All right, so that's fine. He's a 99 right there. So look, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put Cromartie in the slot for now, uh, temporarily, and then um, you know we'll figure out everything else after that. So let's go ahead and just do that. You know, put him in the starting position. Dion will be our starter from now. Uh, so we have 299 overall cornerbacks. Let's check his numbers real quick and see how that works with all the chems. All right, so all of his chems right now are not being added properly. So we're gonna have to back out and um, see what's going on because it, sh it should be more than a 98 uh, zone coverage, obviously, because he has lockdown equipped. So what happens with that, guys, there's a bug in the game where sometimes when you go right to uh, after you update a player, EA Sports, it doesn't process fast enough, so you have to either back out and then go back in on another page, or back out and go back into where you were, and then you'll be able to see. So now he has a 99 uh, man coverage, he has a 98 zone coverage, and an 86 press chem. But you can see clearly with the way that it's set up that the speed, as the speed aspect and its acceleration is green. So this man should be lightning fast. All right, like, and when I'm talking about lightning fast, ridiculous. Now, with Night Train Lane, I believe Night Train Lane goes to a 99 zone, uh, chemmed up. Let's go check that really quickly, just so that I verify that, so that we're all on the same page with that. I just wanna make sure. Um, okay, why isn't it showing his chems? Yeah, look, I, I don't know what EA is doing right now, man. E EA is out here just doing whatever they want, dog. Like, you know what I'm saying? Now, now they're not showing him chemmed up. Okay, there it goes. All right, so he is a 99 zone chemmed up, 99 speed, 98, 98 Excel. Okay, there it goes, it's showing everything now. All right, so with the way all of this is, I will tell you this, I don't know if 98 is the deal or whatever it is, but Night Train Lane plays unbelievable zone. He also has a 98 press, which is not too shabby as well. So those things are huge factors into why Night Train is out of control and obviously his hit power was wild. All right, so that's where we are right now. You can you pretty much see what we're doing right now um, and how we're gonna go about doing it in the future. I don't know, see, it's doing the same thing again. It looks like we're gonna have to, uh, it looks like you have to go to compare in order to see the boost. And then you have to do this to kind of, okay, it's not even showing it on this. You see like how 98, it's supposed to be 98 zone, 99 man. All right, uh, whatever EA is doing, we're gonna go ahead and ignore it. The bottom line is Deion Sanders right now, even with all of the lackluster press, he's good enough to be outside at corner. All right, you everybody knows the game cheats for him already. I think at this point, we're gonna all discover if that green speed all the way out max means anything as opposed to what we've been trying to decipher uh, for ourselves for this long. You know, does it really matter? Is it something that is necessary to win games? We're gonna figure that all out together and we're gonna have a blast doing it. And you know why? Because you guys are here with me and we're gonna go ahead and build our teams together. Let me know, what are you going after right now? Is Deion Sanders the deal or is he not? Let me know, bro. Are you using your 97 overall power pass on somebody else? All my veterans, leave it in the comments. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. One love, y'all.